Despite being newly promoted, Rotherham have made their longest unbeaten start to a season in 65 years. But they came into the match with Colchester having taken only one point in the previous four matches. Their home form has been disappointing too, but they started well at the New York Stadium with Kieran Agard coming close to netting his sixth goal of the season. But it was a former Rotherham player who netted first. Marcus Bean had had a brief loan spell at Millmore six years ago and scored for a second successive away game to give Colchester a seventh minute lead. Rotherham have already taken 11 points from losing positions this season and they're on level terms within 90 seconds. Matt Tubbs scoring the first goal of his loan spell from Bournemouth to end a 16-game and seven-month goal drag. By the midway stage of the first half, the Millers were ahead. Lee Frecklington's header causing panic inside the penalty area. A guard in the right place to cap it lines. Barely 20 minutes on the clock, 2-1 Rotherham. And a first home win in four games beckoned as a succession of chances came their way. Welsh international Mark Bradley seeing a header well saved. Before Tubbs stayed on side to fire an overhead kick over the bar. A chance he may have left for teammate Agar. Colchester had recorded their first win in 13 against Peterborough last week, but they created little here. Luke Garbutt, on loan from Everton, would have scored if his shot had been as good as the run. But Rotherham just couldn't kill them off. Tubbs, who'd been prolific playing under Steve Evans at Crawley, testing Sam Walker as the Millers sought a third. It was a crucial save, because with Walker forward in the fifth minute of stoppage time, Elliot Lee, son of Newcastle legend Rob Lee, scored his first senior goal with the head of the linesman judge to have crossed the line. Rotherham far from happy, they're now without a winning five. 